was a very vintage, uh, at the time not so vintage, but now um, extremely rare uh, headphones. They were uh, released in the 90s, they were really gigantic, big, but everyone was using them, especially in the Netherlands. It was really an amazing piece of gear that just never broke down. Um, the sound was ridiculously good and there was nothing like it. At that time, no one was making headphones and Pioneer was just doing like, the best possible job. I was playing at a local radio station in, in Copenhagen and a friend of mine had bought the DJM 500s and I tried them out and I figured that's never going to catch on. But how wrong I was. <laughs> then uh, the CDJ 1000s came out and it just revolutionized everything. I mean, I only play on Pioneer equipment now so I'm, it doesn't get much better than that honestly. It's, it's just changed the business completely. They started doing the mixes, the 500s, which sounded pretty crappy. The 600 was a bit better. But then, of course, the 800 came, and that was when things really started to get off. Um, I'm still using Pioneer, actually, the 2000 nowadays, which is, I think, the best Pioneer mixer, because it sounds the best, has the best knobs and, and everything. I'm a happy uh, user, yeah, can fairly say that. <laughs> Thank you. 